this ties perfectly into the challenge that you've come up with. Can you please tell us about that? Well, um, that's it. That was it. <laughs> I would, <laughs> okay. The challenge is, so yeah. I've done a little challenge and I've given you paint what you bake. Um, it's direct watercolor painting. Um, no pens because you've only got different shades of brown. Maybe if you've chosen something with little, I don't know, bits of icing or whatever, then you can have a little bit of fun with colors. But when I bake, um, I tend to just, uh, everything is brown. Everything is brown. <laughs> so, um, so I used yellow ochre. I used burnt umber. I used that beautiful color by Daniel Smith which is called transparent red oxide which I adore so those are my three browns and um, maybe a little bit of Naples yellow for some of the the more yellowy brown bits and then um, I always use a Payne's Grey I like the Rembrandt brand of Payne's Grey love it absolutely gorgeous shade beautiful texture for the shadows and then I, when everything's dry, I use a white gel pen to pick out anything that needs picking out, like, for example, the fluff on the edge of the towel, um, which only shows if you have a super dark background. You know, don't bother with your white gel pen unless you've got a super dark background. Um, and that's really the only, the, that's only the literally, I suppose you could say, the icing on the cake. You, you, wow. um, so so that, that, that's about it. But it's fun, and it's not as... Um, if you're not confident with pen work, it's not going to be as frustrating if you just if you just keep on building up your layers with your brush. Okay. okay. And for those of us who don't bake, can we just buy something and paint that? Paint what you buy. <laughs> paint what you buy. <laughs> yes. Pick, I, but buy it because it's pretty rather than because uh, it looks as right, it's going to taste right. good. <laughs> yeah. And I think there are, I actually know a lot of urban sketchers who also like to paint food and the Sometimes they just pick that because it just looks good. Doesn't matter because how it, it looks tastes. good. Because it looks good. Yeah. This is the best reason to draw anything because it yeah. looks good.